Good morning, welcome back to the car. It is Tuesday the 21st and I'm on my way back out to the house to work. Uh, I started a new project on the property yesterday, tearing down wallpaper. And they're wanting to like repaint their bathroom, bathroom and there was wallpaper on one side of the uh, room. So I tore down all the wallpaper on that side of the room to find that they had just wallpapered directly onto unpainted drywall, which is not uncommon. It's just difficult to get up without tearing into the paper of the drywall. And as I was taking down the border around the top, I also found that the entire room had been wallpapered and just painted purple except for one wall. So, we're kind of um, troubleshooting the rest of the room to see what works best. Today I go in to paint one portion of the wall uh, to see how it looks, to see if that's going to be okay, because they've got, it's their rental property and they've got somebody who wants to move in, and so we're trying to get it fixed up and looked and so it looks nice for this next person to move in. Uh, we just didn't realize that there was so much wallpaper. I don't mind taking down wallpaper. It's not the worst thing in the world. But it is difficult. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm, I've got to take down um, the thicker parts of the wallpaper on the wall that's just drywall. And then I have to paint over some of the paint that is um, also wallpaper. Hey guys, what's up? I uh, am covered in paste for one, but I'm also kind of in the park, the drive-through for Dairy Queen for lunch. I'm actually parked in the middle of the main road off of the, an exit ramp, waiting to pull into the drive-through of Dairy Queen. Oh, you gotta pull up further, my guy. Hello, Mr. Dodge. I'm going to get right up in your space. <sighs> because you have plenty of room to pull up. Yeah. And I need to not be on the road. Thanks. I think it's going to rain. I hope it's going to rain. <sighs> well, I'm making progress. If you want to call it that. I'm covered in adhesive. And I painted a wall so that the owner could see the see like what it would look like. And I didn't realize that I rubbed my butt up against it because it's a small door frame. And so now the back of my shirt is covered in paint. And this isn't technically one of my painting shirts, but it's okay. Forgive and forget. But this is um, what it currently looks like. I know you guys didn't see what it looked like before, but this is the shambles in which I have created. And right now, I am taking a break for a minute to come talk to the owner and show her what it looks like and see ooh, what the next move is. <laughs> so, um, I got home from work and I went through my closet. I went through, I'm sorry, I didn't just go through my closet. I went through every article of clothing that I own, including my socks. <sighs> Let me just explain what's happening. So, this is a pile of all of the things that I'm taking to my parents' house because sentimental value. This is all the things that I'm either going to throw away or try to resell. And this is the remainder of my closet. So I got rid of a lot of things because I'm trying to consolidate. 
we're working it out. I'm ignoring the things that are currently in the laundry because those are like obvious things that I, I still wear because they're in the laundry. So there's no point in me like going through it. But I, I think I got rid of like more than half my closet. I finished going through all my stuff and I posted a bunch of stuff for sale on Depop and I've got that pile over here in front of me. I filled two giant, like one of those big black yard bags full of clothes to be gotten rid of and now I'm tired. But yeah, so thanks for hanging out with me today. Um, I've been going through my stuff since about 5 o'clock and it's 10.30 at night. So I'm going to get ready to go to bed now. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.